Good morning, Year One, and welcome to your Thursday's literacy lesson. Today we are going to look at our rhyming words. Okay, so you will need your pen, pencil, and your exercise book. Go and get them. Okay, so for our starter, it says remove un from the words in the bank and add them to the correct sentences. So look at these words with the prefix un. Then take away that un and put the right word to fit the sentence. So the, each sentence says, the winner was so, the angry dog, the path, you need to, your suitcase. Which words do you think will fit in there? Each word can only be used once. Pause it, write out the sentences using the correct word, making sure you take away the prefix. Okay, so here are my answers. Do yours look like mine? So you should have taken away the prefix un, which changes the meaning and makes it the opposite. So the winner was, instead of unlucky, lucky. The angry dog blocked, not unblocked, the path. You need to pack your suitcase. Okay, if you got all those right, well done. Let's go on to our main part of the lesson. OK, so here is my poem again. Now, this time we are going to listen out for the words that rhyme. OK, so we already did a bit of this on Tuesday, so you should be pros at it by now. Are you ready? This is a jungle, green and bright, with luscious leaves that let in light. This is a jungle with loud roars, giant animals that have big paws. This is a jungle that has trees so tall. Can you hear the tiger's call? Okay, so let's see. Did you get bright and light, roars and paws, and tall and call? And as we said on Tuesday, they are all at the end of my line. And that is how you will get your lines to rhyme with each other. So you can see that after the first line and the second line rhyme together, and then we go into a different word. So the third and the fourth line rhyme together and then a different sound again for the last two lines. OK. So let's look at some rhyming words. Cat, sat, mat, rat, pat, bat, hat and fat. What is the difference about all these words? Start with a different letter. That's true, they do all start differently. What's the same about them? It's the ending, isn't it? They all have the at, so the at to make the at sound, so a cat. Sat, mat, rat, hat, fat, bat, pat. OK, so these all rhyme with each other. Which part of the word helps us to rhyme? Is it the start or is it the end? I hope you said the end of the word because the end of the word is the bit that's really important because that's the bit that helps us rhyme. OK, right, let's move on. So I've got our sound chart up here for you to see. Now, what words rhyme with tree? OK, before I ask you to have a go at this, can you see here? Our sounds for E, E. You've got E, what do you see? And E, cup of tea. You've also got the E, he, she, we, be and the y sound that also goes on to make the e sound at the end of a word. So, although the words in the last slide all had the same letters, you might think of some words that have the e sound but isn't spelt with the e what do you see, okay? So that is a little bit of a hint for you. What I would like you to do now is pause the video 
and have a go at thinking of any words that rhyme with tree. Tree. Okay, pause. Okay, so I thought of a few words that rhyme with tree. Free. And that still has that sound. B. C. Agree. Brightly. Can you see how I've got a different ending? But if I look on my sound chart, it's still there for me to use. So, tree. Free. B. C. Agree. Brightly. What words did you come up with? Did you come up with any different to mine? Great. So we have to look at our sound chart as we can see that other sound, other trigraphs and digraphs might look different, but they sound the same. OK, so there's our tree rhyming words. Here are some other things that you might want to think of some rhyming words for. Bear. Bear. Let's look on my... That's where my air is. Air, that's not fair. And air, care and share. So that's actually a different sound to go with. Hours. So you might think of some different words that would rhyme with bear and you can make a list of those. Leaf, E again. So it's got the E sound, but then it's got a F at the end. So you need to think about that as well. Bugs. So again, that's just the O, G. You might have bug, tug. OK. Now, I've put a tiger on here, but I thought you might want to rhyme it with cat, like a wild cat. Cat. And that would help you from the previous slide when we looked at cat, mat, bat. OK, I would like you to pick two of these images, one of these, two of these pictures, and I would like you to list a list of rhyming words to go underneath them. This will help you when you come to write your poems tomorrow because you will have lots of rhyming words to go at the end of your lines, just like I did. OK, so once you've done your two, two groups of rhyming words, you have finished today's lesson. Well done, Year One, and keep up the great work.